Kennywood's Le Cachot, that's French for the dungeon, uses horror film imagery and blacklight technology to create a spooky day glow tribute to the psychedelic 60s. <laughs> This is Le Cachot. It opened in 1972, and it was a retheme of the park's old ride called Safari. It utilized the same building from 1961 to 1971, but even that was a retheme of the park's old ride, Zoomerang, which lasted from 1954 to 1960. And it also utilized the same building, which this building also dates back to the 1920s. There's obviously a reason why I'm telling you the story of this building. It'll be important to the story later. Stay tuned. But let's get back to La Cache Show. So anyway, what does that even mean? Well, in the very beginning of this video, we learned that that means the dungeon in French. So what is this ride actually about? Well, I can tell you, this thing was all about skeletons. Just like hard-headed Harold's horrendously humorous haunted hideaway. That was kind of a thing with Kennywood Dark Rides in the 70s. Let's take a ride on La Cache Show with Charles Jackwist Jr. There goes a buzzard, bye. And now, uh, oh, the bats, the bats. For people who hate bats, they're over our head right now. Ah, bats. A little devil, a little creepy devil looking at you. Oh, 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 oh it's that chain lady there. Oh, laser light. Oh, the light, the light. There we go. We're banging out only one more set of doors. Ah, we're back in civilization again. So that was what the experience was like. It had a lot of stuff going on inside of it. Like the bats, the red devil guy, this green guy right here, and what appears to be some type of zombie guy, the flashing lights. But there was a lot to it. And this ride had a lot of effort put into it. Nothing like the dark rides of Kennywood today. It just shows you how good these old rides were, especially from the 70s era. They had three great dark rides in that era, from the 70s to the late 90s. All of them vanished between the late 90s and the early 2000s. So alongside La Cache Show, there was Gold Rusher, which opened in 1981 and closed in 2007. This video is not about Gold Rusher, so I'm not going to go into too much detail about it, but it was just like that typical 80s dark ride from Kennywood. This was the era of Kennywood's good dark rides. The one notable part is the spider and also the train, which that's actually in the new 2020 Old Mill. Speaking of Old Mill, that was also another ride of that era, but then it got ruined in 2004 by Garfield's Nightmare, which almost two decades later, the Old Mill was brought back in 2020. But going back to that era from the early 70s to the late 90s, what happened to these dark rides? Kennywood had three great dark rides at that time, and none of them exist today. Firstly, Gold Rusher closed in 2007 and was replaced by Ghostwood Estate in 2008. And man, I love that soundtrack for Ghostwood Estate. I love walking by the ride and hearing that. It's not that good to make me want to ride it though. Moving on, we got Old Mill. It got transformed into Garfield's Nightmare. Then it got reverted back to the Old Mill in 2020. And it's not as good as the old, old mill from the 80s, 90s era. Obviously, nothing will be better than that era of Kennywood. And what happened to La Cache? It was replaced by nothing, except some bathrooms and maybe a few trees. So what happened? After the 1998 season, Kennywood closed La Cache. This was because of the building's condition. Remember earlier in the video me talking about the history of this building and how this would become important later in the video? Well, let me remind you. This building dates back to the 1920s. This building, at that time, was around 70 years old. And from a building that's 70 years old, it was deteriorating a lot. So Kennywood decided to close the ride and tear down the building. Which a common misconception of why the ride closed was because the building burned down. Which that actually is true. Partly. When the building was being taken down, it caught on fire. Not as major as Ghost Ship's fire, but it did catch on fire. But the story doesn't end there. In 1998, Kennywood announced their new ride for 1999, Exterminator. This would be a spinning indoor roller coaster with tons of theming on the inside. The theme of the ride is basically you're a rat and you're trying to escape exterminators. 
This was Kennywood's replacement for Le Cachot, even though it wasn't built in the same place as the old ride, but it was built in Lost Kennywood instead, which was their new expansion of the park three years prior, in 1995. The ride opened in 1999 and is still thrilling riders to this day. And the legacy of Lakasha lives on. So what do you guys think of Lakasha? Did you get to ride it? What did you think of it if so? And if you didn't, what do you think of the ride just from its looks? I can guarantee that you'll say that it's better than any other dark ride at Kennywood right now. Let's start a discussion in the comments down below. I'd love to hear your thoughts. And if you're looking for a deeper discussion, join my Discord server. It's linked in the description down below. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications for more content like this. I post tons of other coaster content just like this that you will not want to miss, especially Kennywood content. If you love Kennywood, you're in the right place. I hope you enjoyed the video, and remember, let's ride.